Greetings, this is Kijin and welcome back to Radio in Hellenica mod it's turn four. We have received the 35 gold from the ritual from Arco and we have well, this is actually a pretty unfortunate event. Yeah. Well, but yeah, we also cast again, so 50 gold extra. Um and two battles. So yeah, it looks like this is always a roll of the lionesses, so yeah. Decent number. Our girl shouldn't have any problems, except she took 7 points of damage and it limped her. Uh, I really dislike wound system in this game, I swear to god, it's so stupid. It's, it's not even 10% of her health, and uh, yeah. Oh well. At least she has recuperation, so not a big deal. A long run, but it's just annoying for the you know, future potential of the combat where I then might get just limped from god knows what and or even worse crippled and so on. And the other battle was here. Just a bunch of wolf tribes. Uh yeah, they were slight they're slightly faster than like militia, so they made contact with earlier. But... Yeah, not a big deal. We haven't lost a single one. So yeah, 19 kills, not bad, not bad. Mushu so far. Uh, we took a couple wounds. The worst one is, I guess, Battle Fry. No, sorry, not Battle Fry. Uh, never healing wound on this one, and uh, weakened here, so not a big deal. It's all good. A couple of important things, so... Um, I deducted it, but I also asked uh, Yopa. Is it Yopa? The, the, the different names of the uh, nations. Where does it highlight the name? Oh, there it is. Yapeto. Sorry, Yapeto. So Yapeto's cap is here. So our cap circles are literally touching. Awesome. Um, so because I want to be friend with him, uh, you know. I don't really have any means of warring him effectively, and he certainly can annoy me a lot. But yeah, it kind of ruins my uh, expansion plans because I plan to go here and then bounce here and you know do the carving thing. But all of this and this is his, his cap circle. It's kind of absurd. Um, but I think it would be courteous of me and, you know, to cultivate good relations that okay you know i'm I'm not gonna be contesting those uh go ahead it's it's land provinces that are also really close to me technically because of how the jumps work but it's your cap circle i will not be bothering your cap circle this province unfortunately again shit uh absolutely awful so hopefully this one will make up for it and i will not run into someone already here uh and my goddess will continue like those are merely marcata so i'm not but worried about uh, again not having my dominion there. Uh, one thing also is that here we notice someone else's dominion, so I, I have no idea. I guess it's from here somewhere. So another close uh, enemy from the looks of it, which is how does it happen? It's again, it's 50 pro provinces on average per player. Like, why are we spawning so close to each other? I know it's random, it's just annoying. Um, but I don't know who that is. If if I learn, I, I, if they, for example, go here, like I'll ask them to kindly fuck off and uh, leave my uh, Scandinavia alone. Uh, but yeah, we are running uh, out with our elders, you know, the PD thing, and unfortunately, we didn't get Earth on the NC, so we are recruiting two e ships and hoping for that 1 in 3 earth. We have received uh, those 6 gems from Ulm. Um, yeah. So I could be already crafting the salts or whatever the hell that item is called that will let me make uh, clays. Uh, because, again, me not being able to build it right now, it's like losing 250 income. Uh, actually, no, it's like 125 technically, because I make one every second turn. So, I guess right now I kind of lost 125 income. 
from not not getting that random and um so yeah i'm just pouring whatever i can to making airships and i'm making other mushes so. uh if i had enough gold i would make three airships instead of mushes but i don't so i might as well start making those bad boys um so yeah i guess that will be it no astro uh elder yet um, but uh, that will surely change uh, sooner than later because i'll be making a lot of them also, you see that here are Sashas and Ganas, uh, like the, the amount of undead and just bad provinces. So this will be a dead province, basically. Awesome. Uh, this one is also absolute shit. Uh, this is, I, I, I get it, it's early age. So, you know, like higher chance of um, undead and whatnot. But yeah, the, the provinces around me are so bad. Thank God I have uh, Expander because I'd be in complete ass otherwise. And, and uh, the ritual with Arco is helping a lot with that gold, for sure. Uh, research, uh, you know, it, it gotten better because of those king and the queen that are researching now. And also, <clears throat> yeah, we're down to zero unrest and our defense is starting to climb. I think it's for her turn. Uh, yeah, because it was just one turn, so it's four. Um, otherwise, you know, she's causing population to grow slowly. They will... Have the big ritual when the spring comes, so yeah, all good in the hood. Um, those provinces were better. I mean, I'm hoping I can make it to here without someone else coming out of nowhere, and then those would be some good provinces. I'd like to start uh, a new city, uh, the new fort, before the first year. It costs 1200 for me to do so, it's super expensive, but. Um, you know, it's it's not as big deal if I if I don't get them early because like most of my mages are just one recruitment point, so it's it's fine. I can live on cap for a good amount of time, but of course the more the better. But yeah, a uh, little bit for this turn, and I'll talk to you soon. Welcome back. We have received gold from our Cephali. We've casted repeat again, so we've got 150 gold. Uh, bet shame, bet betel shame has uh, made a profit. The normal commander, that's interesting. Um, anyway, head to battles, one on the shitty rock. Uh, yeah, it just you know, usual weak indies, so nice and easy. Shusu got his first star, so that's awesome. And the other one is our god. Oh, she didn't heal yet. Okay. That's a lot of monkeys. Yeah, they're, they're killing uh, Linuses without an issue. And unfortunately, that broke uh, this guy once this Linus runs out. Yeah. HP route. But yeah, she has no problems killing my girl. Oh, she gets some big hits on her uh, there at the end. How much summon did she take? Like uh, a 16 or so? Uh, but yeah, that's another province. And it's actually, yeah, uh, quite a solid province with Arena uh so yeah that's nice and here we are moving on to that farmland it has decent amount of units so i'm hoping for a good province that could potentially be our new city any further um in a couple turns and um i'm not sure what i will expand uh, towards next uh yet so yeah we'll have to wait and maybe next turn i'll decide it Mm, we are making first down mortar, that's the name of the item. But what will allow my uh, elder to cast the primordial clay and start farming the golden gems from that. We are sending other six nature gems to Ulm and they're sending other six earth gems. I said nature gems, right? Yeah, they're sending six earth gems back. Uh, so that will be nice. And um, right, we are recruiting uh, four of the elders, so you know they do their job, and also one of them will start, you know, casting the Primordial clay. Three Salmis because they are about the most efficient researchers. So it's it's between Gala and Salma. With magic, it's definitely Gala being the most efficient, but uh, Salma is much more useful mage, being uh, water nature cross path. Mm, then yeah, three chosen, so there'll be a guard commanding one of the Salmas when they move out to expand. And I guess that will be it for this turn, and I'll talk to you in a second.
Welcome back. Again, a little bit more gold from Arco, six gems from all for the nature. Uh, that's the event. That's our elder patrolling. And we've got the battles. First one is our goddess. Really nothing fancy here. We're just gonna jump on top of the commanders. It looks like Lioness has actually matched those infantry this time. Eh, she's doing her job. Nothing really uh, oops, impressive. And here is our other party. More or less like planned. Running away pretty much instantly because of fear aura, I'm assuming. I'm happy doing its work. Um, so no losses, brilliant. A couple things, a couple things. Oh, we've got a new neighbor. Well, which are nation of birds. I have no idea how they work. Uh, whatever this is. Uh, and we have talked. We have talked. We have talked because he wanted this province. But I kind of persuaded him to, to actually let me grab it and continue my expansion here while he goes here. There's actually like a ton of farmlands here. Like everything here is just farmlands. And he also likes forests. So like farmland forest is like ideal uh, type for him because I think he forts, his forest can be only built on um, forests. And uh, apparently he's also here because he just was, he started on one of those edges. Um, so yeah, he's just grabbing those rocks and yeah, he moved here. Uh, I also allowed him to grab this province. I don't have particular need for uh, the bone tribe hunters because I can get my own death from my uh, swamp mages. It's a dog shit province and it's dying. So, you know, it's fine. He can grab it uh and uh, owe me a favor or so and we've got the nap five which is unusual i never signed up five with anyone else but i guess due to size of the game and because he's playing burps they're really mobile i think nap five is uh, good for me they're so stealthy but i think if i'll be having a lot of forts you know uh, acting as you know my uh erido expanding right or um i'll have a shitload of PD. So if he tries to raid the provinces that matter, he's just gonna get found immediately. So that's okay. So yeah, we're cutting expansion to this farmland, and uh, we have spotted the dominion here. And I'm sure, not sure who that is. It could be Yapato, I guess. Although I'm not sure how did it get here. I mean, yeah, it's here. I don't, I don't have connection here, so I don't see. So yeah, it could be a pato, it could be a pato. Um, so we're moving with our Salma here. If the guy that's gonna be casting clay and the other lad that will stay there making PD. It should be plenty enough to uh, take all this trash. And uh, yeah, we're casting more tributes. We are also recruiting two galas. Uh, two because one will be casting tribute for now and the other will start going around and building uh, for example lab or temple um and we're getting gudu because i want to start site searching with air um and yeah i want to slap lab here and get the shaman the shamans are those guys right which are crazy crazy good unfortunately not sacred uh, but i guess that's the balancing factor uh to be nuts if they're sacred like that will be a but flag chassis, if, if not even SC level with uh, those two paths. And uh, if you got water, oh my lord. I could technically just give him... Um... Well, I mean, to be fair, like, I don't even need to... I don't need them to be sacred to be thugging, right? My, my thug is uh, a sick temper flesh. And their generation also can come here. Yeah, it could be more, but it's fine. So, yeah, they're like... Probably a really good thugs. Um, research, research. Yeah, we're just shy of alt two, which is unfortunate because it would be nice to be casting mirror image of my god just as an extra defensive layer. But it really shouldn't matter again. Although this is pretty sizable one this time, but it shouldn't matter again. Lonely militia and stuff. Uh, we see even more undead around us. 
Uh, Beard actually told me that he also has undead everywhere. I mean, and such is the charm of early age, apparently. Um, and yeah, uh, we are in works of other party, so in two turns it will be ready and we'll be sending it this way. Um, I just kind of realized, fuck. So because, uh, no, actually, actually this should be possible, right? If it's hot. Um, that's annoying. I'll probably try and, and grid it out with just single Mushusu of this province. And, uh, oh, oh well, why else the next turn? What I really want to do, because the problem is I cannot pass here right now of cold scales here super annoying actually well at worst case scenario i'll just have to return there with my god and take it it's not as big of a deal i guess it just makes my like expansion a little bit more awkward but... hmm. i guess i can just hand her following this this way and uh like take this take this take this yeah yeah i mean that's fine yeah there'll be another mushes waiting here for that purpose, so it will be triple Mushusus uh, expanding. Should be fine. Um, I guess that would be it. All oh, right, then I'm forging uh, sandals, uh, just so I don't forget. Gonna be also a little bit of extra uh, um, research because of increased paths, but it's really not that big of a deal in that uh, particular avenue. Mm, but yeah, uh, main big deal is that I'll be starting to making clays and. Hopefully we'll get some events for both earth and um, water so I can make one or two more of those mortars. But yeah, anyhow, this will be it for now and I'll talk to you soon. Bye bye.